Hello everybody, welcome back to Mason Zero ASMR. Today, I'm going to be playing a round of Fortnite Battle Royale once again. This was a victory royale that myself and my fiance got pretty recently here at the end of Season 7. It's just a couple weeks left of it now. So we landed in... Lonely Lodge, as you can see, which we honestly haven't landed at much recently, although it used to be our primary landing spot, because it's on the edge of the map, but we've gotten more aggressive as time has gone on, which is probably good. So here you can see we're in replay mode, of course. Um, I was not recording the game, because generally I am not recording games. But luckily, replay mode is pretty good and has gotten better. So I'm rocking that level 100 skin. And we're just getting bombarded by this airplane. And I did hit the person in the airplane as well. Um, yeah, anyways, got that level 100 skin. And I actually have unlocked the, uh, the black and red version of it now. But, uh... But this is just the base one, and I'm just trying to get closer to, to Sophia here, and make sure we're not too far away. Uh, that would be Metal Leopard, of course. So I'm showing the plane again. Almost dead, and he's out of the plane. Which I can tell pretty obviously. I didn't know there were people over in that direction, but... Um, I was more worried about the guy that was in the plane. But we're just continuing to loot here. Uh, being, being aware that there could be people nearby. And judging from the uh, replay here, it looks like they're reasonably far away. challenges so we didn't bother um, getting in their way because they weren't bothering us at the time so nothing too exciting going on here of course harvesting materials and trying to get ammo just the usual and then I can't see where the storm is in replay mode of course but I believe we're about to be on our way we're either in the zone or we are close because we seem to kind of take our time to get there but it appears that now we're heading out We used to take this route all the time when we were playing Fortnite duos. Um, Lonely Lodge used to be our favorite landing spot. This was my second or third win of this season. Um, but my fiance needed a win still. So we'd been trying for <laughs> the whole season to get a win. And it was very nice to get one. And we could kind of tell from from the first fight in this game when it eventually happens that, uh, that we were going to do good. You know, we just had a good feeling about this game. But it did have a very slow start. And trust me, we each did get a fair amount of kills. Nothing too crazy. Just collecting more materials and ammo and all that stuff. Score a soccer goal while I'm here. Why not? And just continuing on. I do apologize 
apologize for the beginning of this game being so boring, but I promise you it gets a little more interesting. But right now we're just kind of exploring the countryside, basically. There were a lot of people back there that we haven't run into or don't run into again. I'm stupid and can't get up this hill, of course. <laughs> I'm just making my way around, going past Retail Row, which I assume is a bit of a hot spot, but we actually didn't run into anybody there. Although, now in replay mode, I can see there was apparently a duo pretty far away. I think I have the uh, replay mode set the display be well up to 200 meters away. So, reasonably far. And we each have decent loot here. Looks like we both have blue ARs. Um, and I have a green tactical shotgun. I know that at some point Sophia gets a gold uh, bump shotgun, but I'm not sure if she has that yet or not. So I saw the plane shooting at people, so I'm assuming that there are people down there. And we're about to find out that, that is correct. So we're about to enter our first fight of the game. Where we are going to destroy them. So I obviously have no idea where they are, but then one of them kind of appears there. I hit him good. I don't think I am though. I think Sophia killed both of them. Maybe I killed that one. Who knows, maybe I killed both of them. It's been a few days since this game took place and I, uh, I'm not, I'm not sure. At the end of the game, um, we each had four kills, so should give you an idea. I might have gotten both of these. Got the hand cannon, my, one of my favorite guns in the game, and arguably overpowered. And of course, uh, suppressed SMG, which is just amazing. Love that gun. Seems like I'm rocking the uh, shotgun SMG combo, along with a hand cannon and an AR, which is a very powerful combination. So, this is kind of the dream loadout, just a higher rarity uh, gun uh, for my assault rifle would be nice. There's a kind of few car right there. Uh, not quite there long enough to uh, shoot at. But we decide to follow him anyways. Keep an eye on him. But uh, very quickly, he uh, is gone. <laughs> and there's a giant build battle happening over to our left at the moment, which we decide to stay out of because that's just a lot. So continuing on into this area, maybe into the zone, I'm not sure. That guy on the quad crasher just keeps on going. You can see me looking a lot over at the build battle. And there he goes, flying across the map. <laughs> So, not really worried about him. He seems to be uh, on the defensive, for sure. Or at least aiming to get the high ground. Harvesting more materials. Can never have enough, although with the Valentine's Day update, you can now only hold 500 of each material. So, And I think materials drop 40% more when you harvest them. I believe, so a lot of changes to materials. So now we're moving into uh, Fatal Fields area. And the circle is, of course, getting smaller. Kind of condensing around the uh, frozen area. Just collecting a little bit more ammo here. There's a plane going up. So, trying to stay out of view. 
view of that, because it's not something we want to deal with. Uh, there's another. Oh, okay, this is funny. That's actually the final duo that we end up fighting. I didn't notice their names in the replay before, but yeah, that actually is the uh, final duo. So, spoiler alert, that is who we fight at the very end. You can also see there's this duo to the left of us, which I believe is the winners of that build battle in Retail Row. And believe it or not, we actually didn't run into them while we were running through this field. Um, I'm not sure if they're the next battle that we fight, actually. kind of want to pay attention to those usernames, but they were right over that hill from us because I could see a, a wall being built right there in the zone, but can't see them at all in the actual game, even though I knew they were there. So we each got gold suppressed cars right there, which is awesome. Just a line out in the open, ready, ready to get taken. So there goes the uh, second place team flying away. Just kind of playing cautiously. Don't want to screw anything up. There's fighting happening to the right with the uh, second place team and someone else. And another duo is way over there. running towards Lucky Landing, paralleling that other duo again. So, they must be the duo that we ended up fighting very soon. I guess we'll see. See, we're gonna make it our way to this drop uh, that's over here. Near Lucky Landing. I figure we might as well get some loot while we're, while we're here. But of course, nothing very useful. kind of fortifying here because we're in the zone and nobody know here comes that duo they are on their way well, i can't see them obviously but there goes a bullet from one of them and right here i'm gonna switch to sophia's view she ends up getting hit by a uh Oh, I forget what they're called now, but the ice grenades. And ends up sliding way down the hill. It has to come all the way back up and then just destroys this guy and thirsts him like a savage. So, now we're back to me again. And I am trying to get this guy, but I just can't finish the job. He's very low. But he actually ends up just building way up high, probably because he's so low, uh, and doesn't end up finishing me. Sophia's actually about the same health he is, but since he's building up, decide just to go for the revive. And just in time too, because he starts shooting down at us, and I was convinced that right here we were going to die, that this was the end. He even hits me during that, but then he stops. And I start building pyramids, try to intimidate the guy. Come back out, and there he is, me at my like 10 health. So back to Sophia's view, and destroyed. So I'm feeling pretty good, because <laughs> I barely 
survived that fight. And here I am, able to heal back up again. And Sophia's doing pretty well, also. Just the fact that we're both alive is impressive for us. So I'm putting down some campfires. Healing up, taking bandages, all that good stuff. So it's uh, down to just a few teams now. There's only three or four duos remaining, and I think you can see them all on the map. Let's see, do I take the gold bump? I think I did. Either way, we got a solid loadout. Oh, they actually took a snipe at us from way over there. But that's not really be an issue. I take a little bit of storm damage there, I think. We had us cautiously going into the tunnel or the bridge. And hoping they don't shoot at us again. Just kind of looking out the window, preparing for a fight. You can see that one guy coming down the hill. I go and take a shot at him and hit him for a lot to knock off his entire shield. And then we're going to have Sophia's view again, because she has her heavy sniper. And she is just going to destroy him. Boom. And he is gone. And like the savage she is. Kind of finished the job, but she actually didn't move. He didn't even try to get behind cover, so he's just gone. And this guy comes down the hill, and I just delete him. Then it's just us and the final duo. So they're just trying to get in this drop, apparently. So that allows us to kind of sneak up a little bit and uh, begin on them. But they see us. We start exchanging fire. I get hit for a fair amount, but shield up. And then I decide that we just have to go for it. You know, we always lose games because we're too cowardly. But now I'm just going for it, going up there, and then I'm just going to mess them up. So I come in with the shotgun. Keep shotgunning them, knock that one guy. And then the other guy is about to come out and try to launch pad. But he actually misses his launch pad, and we get the victory royale. So he was very low there. Uh, and he missed his launch pad on the first jump, so he was jumping back onto it. And while he was jumping back onto it, I was able to finish him. So, thank you all for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this Season 7 win. I will see you all in the next one. Good night.